They've been getting it on for Jesus for 25 years. But is it all Hallmark movie hot cocos and rainbows in the bedroom? Bless your heart. Here's the dirt on Candace Cameron Bure's made-for-TV romance. In a story that could have been ripped straight out of a Full House script, the real-life DJ Tanner, Candace Cameron Bure, met her future husband, NHL pro Val Bure, at a charity hockey event in 1994. And it was her co-star, Dave Coulier, who made the official introductions. Candace told HuffPost Live, We went on a date the very next day, and in less than a year, we were engaged. Val had just come from Moscow, Russia, and it turned out that he would watch Full House because it helped him learn English. <laughs> Over two decades later, Candace was still thanking her Full House family for bringing her and Val together. Captioning a 2021 Instagram post, Thank you, Dave Coulier, for taking me to my first hockey game. Thank you, Lori, for being my wing woman. And thank you, Bob Saget, for watching out for me like a dad. Given their wildly different backgrounds, Candace and Val have still managed to maintain a strong relationship for years. Val is a Russian-born pro athlete, while Candace is a Los Angeles-raised child actor. But when it comes to their values, the couple's shared Christian faith is the secret to their bond. As Candace told People, the reality is the glue for us is Jesus. It's the Bible. You know, when there are arguments or we're compromising and in ways it's always like, well, let's just go back to the Bible. It's the foundation for us. So it's not about winning or losing, but doing this journey together. Candace affirmed the importance of their faith for their 25th anniversary. Among a laundry list of qualities like grace, communication, sex, and patience, she posted to Instagram, I believe God is the secret sauce. It should come as no surprise that this couple have adopted traditional roles in their marriage. As Candace wrote in her book, Balancing It All, I chose to fall into a more submissive role in our relationship because I wanted to do everything in my power to make my marriage and family work. I have always firmly voiced my opinion, but when it comes down to us ultimately not agreeing on something, I submit to his leadership. Don't have the expectation to be superwoman. I once did and realized that we can't do it all perfectly well at the same time. As for Val, Candace says her hubby naturally fell into the lead role in their household. But as the actor noted to Christian Women Online, Val doesn't take advantage of me, but rather gains respect for me and chooses to love and honor me as I do him. Considering the couple's conservative values, fans may be shocked to learn that Candace isn't shy when it comes to talking about intimacy with her husband. On the Confessions of a Crappy Christian podcast, Candace revealed, If we are to promise ourselves for one another and preach saving yourself for marriage, then sex needs to be celebrated within marriage. And celebrate it, they do. As Candace explained to Daily Blast Live. The longer that you're married, it's so easy to take each other for granted or you have to keep it spicy. And I love that. That's my husband and I do. Just in case you still have doubts, she also told OK, we have sex any time of the day, even if the kids are home. OK, guys, it's family time. Like, you can do this on your own. No one can say that these two haven't put in the work to make their marriage thrive. But it hasn't always been smooth sailing. During the early months of the pandemic in 2020, they hit a rough patch with Candace telling Yahoo Life, All the things that we have avoided for years <laughs> talking about, they all surfaced and they were in our face. Thankfully, they had her parents, who have been married for more than 50 years, to look up to. Candace told Us Weekly, When you see people that are committed to each other to stick through those tough times and be willing to grow and learn and not walk away because that could be the easier choice, I mean, it's incredibly inspirational. Fortunately for the Bure marriage, the pandemic has strengthened our relationship. The couple are big believers in open, honest, and frequent conversations about their needs. As Candace shared with People, it's really about looking after your spouse's needs and then looking at your needs. If you really want to honor them, you try to do what's best for them and for your whole family. It's hard to not be selfish. That's really, I think, the key to a long-lasting marriage. You're in it, and you gotta stay in it, even yeah. though you don't wanna be in it. Fans can see this compromise in how the couple has taken turns in their careers. In the early 90s, after Full House wrapped, Candace stayed home to raise the couple's three kids, while Val continued his NHL run. Then, in the early 2000s, Val retired from pro sports and became the stay-at-home parent while Candace returned to acting. Because of their careers, Candace and Val spend a lot of time apart. And in 2018, Candace joked to Us Weekly that the secret to a happy marriage was traveling a lot. You know, being away from each other yep. makes the heart grow fonder. <laughs> but because of that, date nights have always been key for their marriage. They'll do dinner nights alone, walk and talks, and even vacations minus the kids. All of that helps keep that romantic spark alive. As Candace told Closer, 
I think that you should keep dating your spouse. It can get monotonous at home. Another way the couple builds their bond is by running a company together. And in 2012, the pair turned their love of wine into a legitimate business with Napa Valley's Beret Family Wines. Today, their award-winning offerings are almost impossible to get your hands on unless you earn a coveted spot on the list. While Val handles most of the business end of the brand, he and Candace both renovated the home that came with the vineyard. And by all accounts, it's been a success. And we knew we wanted to produce the best of the best wines in Napa Valley. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more Nikki Swift videos about your favorite celebrity couples are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.